Welcome to the second episode of Cooking with Chris. We got some burgers going. You guys know how to do that, right? So on my counter, I'm going to set this up for you guys. We got some stuff. I got this as a recipe. I got specifically... Um, I got burgers specifically for this. Uh, a lot of my seasoning and herbs and spices have burger recipes. Um, this one... Yeah, uh, red pepper. I have so much red pepper. So on here, we got firecracker burgers. Okay, and I'm gonna read this to you, and you're gonna guys are gonna watch this raw meat cook and burn. So you mix one pound of ground beef, a quarter cup finely chopped onion, one tablespoon of parsley flakes. You got parsley flakes. Okay, a half teaspoon each garlic salt and ground black pepper yeah and one quarter oh i'm getting burned ah. okay quarter teaspoon ground red pepper we got that uh shape into four burgers i did three burgers i ran out of meat um grill over medium heat for 10 minutes or until cooked through turning once pretty easy it's with the mccormick ground cayenne red pepper uh, pretty pretty great. I got I'm gonna make sure I'm on medium heat. But then I got some McCormick garlic salt. I got some Kirkland uh, fine ground pepper. I got some Lowry seasoning salt. I got some crumbs on my counter, and I got some parsley flakes, which also has the recipe. No, I didn't do that one. I haven't made that yet. Herb bread. That doesn't sound very good to me. But uh, deviled egg sounds amazing. A loaded mashed potato casserole. Salmon and herb sauce. That sounds pretty good. Uh, we got some other recipes we might do later. Um, if my music career doesn't take off, then maybe my uh, cooking career will. So, these have been going for a little bit. Oh man, I left the water running. Why would you guys allow that? I don't think I have a clean spatula. Ooh, I've got a, I've got a half a spatula. How about that? You guys have a half a spatula? These things are gonna be burnt to crap. Ow! 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 ow. It's so ow! Ah! Ah! <laughs> Ah, ah, ah. I'm getting burned as bad as these little three little round cows. Oh my gosh! Ah, so much oil, so much oil. Flip, ah, ah, baby cow. Now I got four burgers. Four burnt burgers. Yeah. All right, we're gonna zoom in on this. Okay. So I got I had some uh, really old hamburger meat and uh, and some seasoning. That's all you really need, guys. Um, I don't have any hamburger buns. So I'm gonna take some uh, Wonder Bread. I had to get Wonder Bread. They were out of butter bread. Because, you know, the world is coming to an end. So I got some Wonder Bread. I'm going to toast it in my toaster. And uh, I'm going to put a little bit of probably cheese on it. You guys, are, look at my refrigerator. Blessed. Got some leftover spaghetti, coffee, milk, some chopped onions, some yogurt, peppers. Look at all this stuff. This is, uh, yeah, I'm cooking with cheese now what kind of cheese do you guys want probably this kind right probably the uh, American I've got I do have uh, Swiss I got some Gouda and all kinds of shredded cheese in there you guys want to take a look at my freezer oh man I got some leftover chicken I got corn a lot of uh, spaghetti uh, pancakes toaster strudels and uh, mixed veggies for some of my other recipes 
So right now we're gonna take some sliced cheese. We got burgers burning. Okay, I need a plate. You wanna go in here, you wanna get a plate. This one's nice and chipped, so it'll be a good one. Hey, how about this, guys? I don't really want to be in my cooking videos because I don't, I don't want to get dressed. So I'm gonna get some bread, and Buddy's gonna come in here and join us. Bread. Okay, we got a Chihuahua. We got bread. 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 That's not enough bread. Bread! Bread! Okay. That's some Wonder Bread. Alright. The Wonder Bread goes back over there, guys. You know what time it is. There's a Chihuahua eating some celery. Alright. We're going to take... We got... Uh, ooh, we're going to have to unplug some stuff because my kitchen cannot handle the oven, the coffee maker, and the toaster at once it will cause a nuclear reaction. So you're gonna take this and unplug it from the wall. You're gonna take the toaster. This, yeah, this part, uh, have you ever seen, you guys, uh, Okay, I'm dead now, so I don't know if I'm gonna be able to narrate the rest of the video. We're gonna turn this down a little bit. Uh, they still need a lot of uh, time. Maybe poke them, poke them with the this thing, this half a thing, a little bit. We're gonna get the toaster going. Are you guys ready? Uh, this is bread. Um, bread is is good food. Sometimes you don't want to drop it in here all haphazardly and uh, press these buttons. Okay. That's going to go a little bit. I like gooey, soggy toast. I don't know about you guys. Buddy likes gooey, soggy toast as well. Okay. Boom, ba -dum, ba -dum. Mm, this is going to be a terrible lunch. I love it. So what else do I need? I got my cheese. I got my burgers with onions. I already did. I, you guys missed the uh, chopped onions. Uh, I just put them all in a bowl kind of dipped the burgers in it. It didn't really go so well. So I just sort of sprinkled all my uh, seasonings on the burgers outside because uh, the patties were pretty much in patty form already. So I didn't, you know, like mix up all the meat and everything. Um, but yeah, here's my, my chipped plate. We're going to want to zoom in to the chip in the plate. Uh, it's kind of, oh, it's not dirty. It's just that uh, bread. So uh, yeah, this is a plate. Um, I, I use plates to eat off of uh, sometimes when I feel like it. I've got my toast going. And we're gonna, I know you guys are foodies. Uh, so maybe one day, you know, maybe I could start a series where I'm, you know, where you watch me eating this food. Uh, that could be cool. Uh, I know a lot of people do that. A lot of people pay for that, so uh, I don't know. Here's a Chihuahua, buddy. What's up? What's up, buddy? Are you supposed to? Oh no! Hello! Oh, the toast is ready. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. The toast is ready. The toast is ready. Yeah, is it ready? All oh, the toast is ready. So you're gonna wanna like do not stick forks in here. I did that. One time, oh man. Ah! 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 It's pretty light. Uh, oh, that's a little bit darker than I like it. Oh, did you see that catch? One hand, baby. I don't know you. Like and subscribe, like and subscribe. Like and subscribe, like and subscribe, like and subscribe, like and subscribe. Burgers are almost here, guys. We're going to take this over to the uh, sandwich making station. This is probably, I don't know, I don't know, these feel kind of, I bet this little burger is done. Yeah, burger number four.
nice and uh, burnt to a crisp. Uh, I actually prefer to eat raw meat, but you know, that wouldn't be much of a cooking video if it was just raw cheeseburgers. So you're going to want to take the spatula and put the burger on the bread. I'm going to show you again because you guys probably won't be able to figure this out. Okay. Burger on top of the bread. You guys got it? Now, maybe I'm going to do the big burger. Big. Oh, man, this is... Oh, man, I've got more burgers than bread. I'm confused. Oh, man, I don't, I don't really know what's happening right now. I don't know what to do. Oh, man, I thought I stepped on my dog, but I stepped on an onion. So we're going to take this cheese. You, you really want to take this plastic off. It's really not a good day when you forget to do this part. So that's a really important step. That is step 792 of how to make a cheeseburger, but it's a red pepper, garlic pepper, seasoned salt, parsley burger, okay? You wanna throw your trash in a trash receptacle if possible, if you have one. Um, now you also want to, um, you're gonna wanna get some condiments, okay? Now you guys saw in my refrigerator earlier, I have condiments. This is a giant condiment. Okay? You're going to want to open the condiment and pour the condiment on the burger. Now this is the finest ketchup that money can buy. You guys probably can't afford this. It's great value condiments. What's going on? Okay, I don't know. Something was going wrong with the camera. This is a great value ketchup. You guys cannot afford this because you guys are YouTube viewers and not YouTube creators! That burger is still burning. We want to turn it off by turning the, the temperature down. This is Cooking with Chris! Like and subscribe! Okay, you're going to want to put the bread on top of your sandwich guys very complicated stuff going on here you're going to want to take your greatest ketchup ever you're going to want to put it back in the refrigerator so it doesn't rot ketchup rots at room temperature bet you guys didn't know that did you i've got a full battery this video could go on for hours you're going to want a dirty microwave you're going to want to take your hand and take your plate of foods. Do not leave your hand in the microwave. It will hurt when you do this. And it will hurt when it breaks off. You're going to want to do cook time. You have to have a microwave just like this or this won't work. Then you're going to go to these buttons, these dirty buttons with no germs on them. And you want to do, I'm going to say, you, you got to go with your gut instinct. You just got to be like one uh, eight. That is my gut instinct. And then start. Eventually, it will start. Boom! Microwave! Microwave! But it's not a small wave! It's a nice day today, guys. It's a, I might go outside later. Uh, you know, my kitchen's clean. Look at that. Those are pretty. My bread's pretty. My dirty rag towel's dirty. I mean, it's clean, it's pretty. Okay, my microwave's done. Okay, so, here you guys, here you guys go, guys. Here you guys go, guys. Now, we got one left over. We're probably gonna eat that too, because it's not, it's not healthy just to eat two burgers or three burgers. Uh, this little fourth burger is a little tiny, so we'll probably have to make seven more burgers for lunch, but, oh gosh so hard okay okay guys and this is gonna be my plating uh, so if you know for if you're like uh, fancy and like the plate this is this is how you would properly plate this okay you ready all right now I'm gonna properly plate this other one 
Okay, this is a, a cheeseburger, a firecracker cheeseburger with fancy ketchup. Watch this, you're going to want to plate it uh, extra properly so a Gordon Ramsay won't be mad at you. Watch this. Okay guys, thanks for watching my video. Uh, that's been uh, episode two of Cooking with Chris. You guys have a good day and um, a mediocre night. Bye.